hey guys a very good day to you all so before starting off with the wave theory of light one small request to you all is that in the in the front of your screen you can see a uh, icon of my channel please do click on it and get subscribed to the channel and also at the right bottom column or uh, right bottom of your screen you can see a small red color subscribe button do click on it and subscribe to the channel as you will find all the videos of 11th and 12th science so a uh, wave theory of light so the wave theory of light was basically proposed to prove that light travels in the form of wave so there are few characteristics of wave theory of light the first characteristic of wave theory of light is that they said that the wave of a light travels in the form of longitudinal waves so according to the first characteristic they said that the light travels in the form of longitudinal waves so what is a longitudinal wave at one end we have compression and at the other end we have rarefaction so this completely forms one longitudinal waves but later on it was proved that light does not travel in the form of longitudinal waves but it travels in the form of transverse wave so this is a transverse wave and it was proved that light does not tra uh, travel in the longit in the form of longitudinal waves but it travels in the form of transverse wave okay according to the second characteristic of wave theory of light it states that different colors of light are due to different wave wavelengths so over here you can see that this is one longitudinal wave and it is signified by lambda so this longitudinal wave has its particular value given in armstrong so according to the second characteristic of wave theory of light it was said that different the value of armstrong we will get different colors so on dependent on depending on what is the value of armstrong that is what is the value of wavelength of this one wave it will produce different colors and third point is very easy that when light enters our eyes we get the sensation of light and the fourth point what fo what fourth point states that light cannot travel in the vacuum so they said that light cannot travel in the vacuum that is where there is no medium it needs particular medium to travel so these are all the characteristics of wave theory of light a uh, wave theory of light was not completely correct it was it had certain drawbacks also but it was successful in explaining the laws of reflection refraction interference and diffraction and also the wave theory predicted that speed of light in an optically denser medium is less than that in an optically rarer medium so this was all about wave theory of light you can uh, click on the next video uh, which you can see that is wave front and wave normal and again do subscribe to the channel icon if you have not done in the starting and do like and share the video